Family Ties, a 1982 television series, epitomized an era blending laughter and poignant family dynamics into a cultural cornerstone. It challenged norms by portraying the clash of values between liberal parents and their conservative offspring, navigating the societal shifts of the time. Its relevance remains, prompting reflection on the timeless theme of generational differences. Did you catch it during its initial run or discover it later? This show's enduring quality lies in its ability to capture the essence of familial relationships in a changing world. Its characters, notably the iconic Alex P. Keaton, personified the ideological tug of war prevalent in many households, fostering relatability that transcended its 1980s setting. What about you? What's your most cherished memory or personal experience connected to family ties? We'd love to hear your stories and reflections in the comments below. Share your journey with this iconic series. And now, some interesting trivia about the show. Michael J. Fox, who portrayed Alex P. Keaton, wasn't initially considered for the role, but his audition changed the producers' minds. The character's iconic Mallory nickname for his sister was an improvisation by Fox that stuck throughout the series. Your turn. Share your thoughts and memories with us about family ties in the comments section below. Let's reminisce together about this timeless series that continues to resonate with audiences across generations. Family Ties, a beloved 1980s TV series, captured the essence of changing times with its insightful portrayal of a middle-class American family. The show originated as a response to the conservative shift in the United States during the late 70 seconds and early 80 seconds. Its premise centered around the Keatons, an atypical family where former hippies Stephen and allies raised their kids in Columbus, Ohio. The clash of ideologies was ingeniously depicted through the parents' liberal views juxtaposed with their son Alex P. Keaton, an ambitious, suit-wearing Reaganomics enthusiast. The show's uniqueness lay in its ability to infuse humor while addressing substantial societal changes, making it both entertaining and thought-provoking. Alex, portrayed by Michael J. Fox, became an iconic character, emblematic of the era's conservative youth counter to his liberal parents. The dynamic interplay of personalities within the family, including sisters Mallory and Jennifer, added depth and relatability to the show. Family Ties left an indelible mark on popular culture, not just for its witty writing and engaging characters, but also for its exploration of pertinent issues. It navigated topics like politics, gender roles, and generational gaps with finesse, resonating with audiences across various demographics. Its impact transcended its original run, influencing subsequent TV shows by setting a standard for family-centered sitcoms, that incorporates social commentary and relatable dynamics. Even years after its conclusion, its legacy endures as a quintessential representation of a bygone yet pivotal era in American culture. The creation of the 1982 TV series Family Ties stemmed from the real-life experiences of producer Gary David Goldberg and his wife Diane. Modeled after their transition from former hippies into suburban family life, the show portrayed the Keatons, an atypical American family residing in Columbus, Ohio. This portrayal of a middle-class family navigating changing times struck a chord with audiences, resonating for its authenticity and relatability. Goldberg's personal journey influenced the essence of the show, highlighting the clash of ideologies within the Keaton family. As the series progressed, Michael J. Fox, portraying Alex P. Keaton, emerged as an iconic figure emblematic of the era's conservative youth. However, Fox has expressed regret in interviews, acknowledging that other characters were overshadowed to highlight his role, particularly noting Meredith Baxter Burney's concerns during production. Baxter Burney, a seasoned actress, brought depth to her portrayal of Eli's Keaton, adding layers to the show's exploration of family dynamics and societal shifts. The series, beyond its entertainment value, became a platform to address pertinent issues like politics, gender roles, and generational gaps, leaving a lasting impact on popular culture. Family Ties endures as a quintessential representation of a pivotal era in American television, blending personal experiences with societal commentary. The character Stephen Keaton from the 1982 TV series Family Ties holds a prominent place in television history. He was ranked 12 in TV Guide's list of the 50 greatest TV dads of all time. 
Stephen, portrayed by Michael Gross, epitomized the compassionate yet firm paternal figure that resonated deeply with audiences. His portrayal contributed significantly to the show's success, adding a layer of relatability and warmth to the Keaton family dynamics. The recognition of Stephen Keaton among the greatest TV dads underscores the impact and lasting impression of family ties on viewers, solidifying its legacy as a quintessential representation of family life in the 80 seconds. The cast of the 1982 TV series Family Ties harbored a rather dark desire for the show's conclusion on that veered starkly from the typical upbeat tone of sitcoms. Surprisingly, the cast wished to conclude the series with a tragic event, the entire Keaton family meeting their end in a plane crash. This inclination toward a grim finale stemmed from their collective opposition to the idea of a future reunion show. Despite the warmth and relatability the show exuded, the cast's desire for closure carried a somber tone. The prospect of ending the series with such a drastic and final event added an unexpected layer to the behind-the-scenes sentiments of the beloved family-centered sitcom. President Ronald Reagan's declaration of this being his favorite television show led to rumors of talks for him to make a cameo or guest-starring role on the series. The show gained significant attention after Reagan expressed his fondness for it, sparking speculation about his potential appearance. However, despite the rumors, Reagan never made a formal appearance on the show. This declaration, coming from the president, stirred considerable interest and discussion around the series, drawing attention not only to its entertainment value but also to its potential influence in popular culture and politics. Alex and Ellen's love theme in the 1982 TV series Family Ties became an unexpected hit. Their romantic storyline featured the song At This Moment by Billy Vera and The Beaters, initially released in 1981. Despite going unnoticed at first, its use in the series sparked a resurgence. The single was re-released in 1986, hitting number one on the Billboard Top 100 pop chart in early 1987. This newfound success showcased the power of television in revitalizing music and catapulted the song to the top, defining an era of romantic sentimentality. As the credits roll on this nostalgic journey through the iconic 1982 TV series, Family Ties, it's time to ponder the strings that tether us to its enduring charm. Whether you're drawn to Alex P. Keaton's unwavering ambition, Mallory's endearing innocence, or the heartfelt dynamics of the Keaton family, there's something remarkably human about these characters that lingers within us. Perhaps it's the resonance of their challenges mirroring our own, the laughter shared over their misadventures, or the moments that struck a chord in the symphony of our lives. Whatever it may be, Family Ties has etched its place not just on screens but within our hearts. As we bid adieu to this memorable show, take a moment to reflect. What memory stands out? Which character left an indelible mark on your thoughts? Share your thoughts, your anecdotes, your musings about this beloved series. Let's weave a collective tapestry of recollections that celebrate the essence of Family Ties and the connections it forged. Thank you for joining in this trip down memory lane and for sharing your cherished moments. Your stories enrich the legacy of this cherished show, making it timeless in our collective reminiscence. Until we meet again to unravel the threads of another treasured narrative, cherish those memories. Farewell for now.